So I often get asked about the frame rates when it comes to the Fusion titles and if they work with frame rates not listed. The short answer is yes, they will, but I guess I should explain how Fusion titles work and Fusion for that matter. Fusion itself is frame based when it comes to time. So the duration of the Fusion title itself is stated by frames. So the easiest way to understand this, the 30 frames per second Fusion title is 150 frames. If you play that at 30 frames per second, that's five seconds. In the same way with the 60 frames per second one is 300 frames. Now, what happens if you take one of those animations and you put it on a different frame rate? Well, it just plays at a different speed. So if I was to, let's uh, set up this project here. So currently it's at 30 frames per second. And then we'll just come in here and put in, let's do the clean pack. And we'll just bring in this animation, right? So currently the project's 30 and this one is the 30 frames per second uh, animation. So we come through and throughout this whole five seconds, this is the default length when it comes in. Over that five seconds, we will have the whole animation. Now, if we were to grab the 60 frames per second version, and by default, it's going to be five seconds. When we play this through, what you'll notice is that it's only halfway there. So what we would actually have to do, is I'm just gonna hold Alt to move this quick. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to bring this over because the reason why I'm lengthening is because this animation is 300 frames long. I'm only playing at 30 frames per second, so it's gonna be longer. So now if I play this, I will have the whole animation going all the way across. And same way with the 25 frames per second, it's just going to be a little and a little shorter. So theoretically, all of these will work with any frame rate. By default, the fusion titles, when you bring them onto the timeline, they're five seconds in length. So the 25 frames per second one is going to be by default, a five second animation at 25 frames per second, 30, it's going to be a five second animation at 30 frames per second. And the 60 is going to be a five second animation at 60 frames per second. Obviously you could put these any which way you want, have them go faster, slower, but that's how the animations are set up. The only caveat to this are the dynamic titles. They will be listed as any frame rate. Let me show you one. If I do block and I bring one of the block titles in, what you'll notice is that there's no uh, time frame. I have nothing here. And if I play this, it, I have my animation on and it's viewed and then it comes to the end and I have my, uh, it's snapped, but I'll turn that off. It has the animation off. Now, if I lengthen this, what you'll notice is we still have our animation on. And then at the end of this, we have our animation off. So this is kind of one of those that's dynamic. I can move this any which way I want to. It doesn't matter what the frame rate is of the project. I can move it any which way I want to and the animation will always be dictated by the length of the actual title on the timeline. Some of these are static, some of them are dynamic. In the description, it states if it works with any frame rate or if it has very specific frame rates, that means that it's a static animation. It really depends on the title itself and how it was put together. But if you have any other questions in the contact page, you can submit your question and I'll be more than happy to help. But with that being said, have a good day.